What's up guys, it's Nicole here and welcome back to my channel. In today's video I'm going to be showing you guys my filming setup and that's why I'm filming on my phone right now so that I can show you all of it like just together and with my camera and everything. So yeah, we're just going to get straight into it and I will show you guys what equipment I use and also what I used to use and yeah, let's dive right into it. Okay, so I am taking it back to what I first used when I started YouTube and literally I just used natural daylight for my lighting. Um, I had my blinds open all the way and that's what I was using for lighting and then I could just edit it on the computer and, you know, make it brighter and all that. So that is what I used for lighting at the beginning of my videos and I also used for at the beginning of my videos, I use the same camera that I'm using now. I haven't gotten a new one or anything like that. I mean, it's okay for now. So I've still been using that camera. And for my tripod that I used to use, it was this one right here. This was the first tripod that I had. And it's okay. It was only a cheap one from eBay. And it wasn't that sturdy. Like, not for a camera like mine, it wasn't that sturdy. So... I don't know, I would recommend getting a good tripod, one that you can carry around with you and one that you know is going to last for a long time. So yeah, but this one's alright. I mean it has a 90 degrees vertical platform, a quick release video photo platform and center brace column and stuff like that. But yeah, it's okay, it wasn't that great. So the tripod that I use now I actually got from, I think it was Harvey Norman, I'm pretty sure it was Harvey Norman. And it is the EX series, EX330. It just looks like this, like a simple black one. And it rotates. Oh, <laughs> and it rotates and does all of this stuff here. It's got like three leg opening thingy or <laughs> whatever it's called. I don't know what it's called. But um, it's really good. I really, really like it. And yeah, it's just, it's good to carry around as well. It comes with a carry bag if you wanted to take it around. And yeah, it's awesome. So I really like it. I will show you guys what it looks like. This is the tripod in the middle here. And it's got like, you know how it's got like these opening things? Yeah, it's got that. And it's got three of those. So you can do it three times. Um, which I have opened and it is a good height and it's really sturdy and I really really like it Speaking of tripods, we'll move on to my lights now So these are the lights that I use now for filming which are awesome They literally just turn on and they are super bright and it just makes the whole room extra bright But this is the lights and they're really high they go higher than this as well and I'll show you guys what it came with, where I got them from, and all of that good stuff. For my camera, I use the Nikon D3100. And this one doesn't have a pull-out screen, so that is why I have a mirror right there. So I can see what the screen looks like while I am filming. And while I'm sitting down and everything, I can see it from there and that is how I see what's going on. I'm really really dying to get a camera with a screen that opens up and stuff because it would be so easy to film with but yeah. This is literally what my filming setup looks like. It's super simple and I like it for now. It's working. So for the lights you can see the difference now. I'm pretty sure that now that they're on but I got them off eBay for literally like 50 or 55 dollars for both of them which is awesome and it came with the two tripods and it came with the two big as light bulbs this is what the box for the light bulbs look like and it came with those two like umbrella -y kind of things that photographers use in their stuff like for reflecting light and all that it came with two white ones and it came with two black ones so that is awesome i mean it's a great deal for 50 dollars. so that is why i got it and i'm pretty sure it's like the best decision that i've ever made for my filming i will try and find the link for you and list it down below so that you guys can check it out for yourselves if you guys want to purchase any lights um this is not sponsored obviously it's ebay and i just love ebay but yeah so that is literally it for my filming guys. That is literally it for my filming setup guys. I hope you enjoy this video. I also have this stuff in the background which you can usually see in my videos. 
But yeah, I hope you guys liked the video. If you did, please give it a big thumbs up. And I would love to know what you got. But I would love to know what you guys use for your filming setup. And yeah, let me know down below. So I will see you guys in my next video. Thank you for watching. Bye.